Welcome to the NBA moment. What is it? Probably John Stockton. Mm. He cooked you? He, like, stole the ball from me. Like, three times. <laughs> Imagine, like, just getting in the game and you look up trying to get an a inbound pass and that shit gone. <laughs> you think you got a steal and it's like, oh, man, I got a steal and that shit gone. I could have played, like, eight minutes that night. But like them first two minutes, it was just turnover, 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 bucket, and one, and one. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? Go back in, the same shit. You just couldn't find them, bro. It was embarrassing. And then I would say the other one was Stefan Marbury. You know, I'm a rookie coming off the bench. He was like, yeah, and one. And he looked at me, he was like, yeah, you don't want none of this. You can't guard me. And Eldon Campbell was like, ooh, you gonna let him talk to you like that? Sup? So I'm on the bench, hot. I'm ready to fight everything. Uh, but that was like, he was cooking me too. First person to bust my ass, DeMarcus Cousins, bro. Now, I knew about DeMarcus Cousins. I knew he was big bully inside, but like, I didn't realize he had every fucking thing. They had the handle, they had the shot. It was in there like mixing it up. Nigga was boarding. So I go there, he going crazy, bro. He, he had to have like 45, 50 points. They get in there, this nigga's going crazy. Nigga dunking, like shooting threes hit me he had hit me one time so hard i kind of fell on my ass he was like you a baby and i was like damn i didn't know what to say back <laughs> i like it, when, he, when he hit that it, it kind of broke talking about the shit talk it kind of broke my confidence for a second it's like there's nothing i can say i'm not gonna fight this nigga like i don't know what i can say in that like opportunity so i didn't know what to do probably finished that game with like 12 points or something like that and it made me reconsider a lot of shit like all right uh. <laughs> yeah <laughs> Welcome to yeah. <laughs> welcome to the yeah. Welcome to the yeah. yeah. Do you have a, a welcome to the league moment? I mean, it was probably last year when we played the the Lakers. Um, it was like our fourth game of the year. I mean, we started out the, the year I think played like Orlando, Cleveland. So not to t not to say anything bad about you know those teams or anything like that. I mean, obviously Cleveland's doing some special stuff this year, but um, you know I hadn't seen like any true superstars yet. And then I think game four, we play a healthy Lakers team. And it's like, you know, LeBron, AD, all of them. And um, I'm picking up LeBron full court. And it's like the end of the end of the quarter. So, like, I'm trying to be pesky on the ball. And he just put a forearm on me. And I'm like, oh, my God, this dude's strong as shit. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so that was kind of like my welcome to the league moment. Just like, you know, I mean, I've fulfilled a, a lifelong dream of mine. My welcome to the NBA. My rookie season, 95, we in Mexico City preseason. I'm with the Bullets. A year before they started calling them the Wizards. So on the team. You older shit, man. They were still called the Bullets. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> so, <laughs> Mexico City, we playing the Spurs. Mm. All right, I'm going up against David fucking Robinson. <laughs> he bust my ass. Yeah. He bust my ass, bro. There was nothing I could do with him. 30 points, 18 rebounds in 30 minutes. I remember that stat line. He was stronger. He was just as fast. He was just as athletic. And, you know, for like, you know, two, three dribbles to get to the basket, put it on the floor. He's what, like 7'1", 7'2", isn't he? He's like he's seven, true, he's true like footer? 70. Yeah, yeah he's true footer. Like us. Like us. You know what I'm saying? You see how big we sitting on this couch? Yep. Nothing I could do with him, dog. Bust my ass. What was your NBA, like, rookie welcoming to the NBA moment? Uh, I can say after that, after that, I got drafted before the summer league. And, uh, you know, we were working out with the team. Uh, for getting ready for summer league, and KJ dunk on me in the practice. KJ yeah, 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 he dunk on me in the practice. You know, I used to get like every shot in Turkey. Like I was a like block leader and, and other things in uh, Turkey, which is the surprise for you know for you guys. <laughs> and yeah, I give him space. I like, I wasn't knowing him. Yeah. you know, I didn't know who the KJ are before yeah. I came NBA. And uh, I give him space to, um, and I can jump with him in the same time, you know? And uh, he go the <laughs> fucking too fast left, right, and go with the left, you know? And then I was a little late, and he dunked on me. 
but I didn't even see he dunked on me or not. I just felt, and then I said, <laughs> I, it was my Turkish uh, guy over there. I said, they don't, did he dunk on me? And then he said, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> and then everyone was telling me, oh yeah, welcome to the NBA, welcome yeah. to the NBA. Man, I love telling this story, I'm not gonna lie. Man, we were in, we were in Portland. We're playing Dame. I think, I think Dame had, the start of the game, I'm guarding him. They're like, you're gonna guard Dame, accept the challenge. I'm like, oh, cool, let's do it. So we're out there and I'm just like in awe, like just Dame, you're literally, wow. So I, I'm still in awe through maybe the whole first quarter, I'm in awe. This dude pulls up, deep ball, three, come down, foul on me, and one. Look up, deep ball, three, another one, another one. Just back, it just, it, looked, it felt like it was just all out. I was on this island by myself, like no one, no one was there to help. Kobe, they call timeout. Kobe looks at me, he's like, what you want the motherfucker to have, 50? And I'm like, I don't even know what I, I was just like, I, I, you know, one of those. Kobe goes out and guards him. This is when I saw, first of all, that was my welcome to NBA moment. Just Dame fucking having, un, I don't know what he had. But then seeing Kobe guard him and just beat him up, basically. Like, they weren't letting Kobe foul out of that game one. And he just beat him up. He probably had 50 on me and in the game probably 50. You know, like just Kobe just, he shut it down. But I watched the refs kind of let Kobe beat the shit out of him to do it. And I was just like, man, that's that's just reputation one. And then two, like, damn, refs really <laughs> control the game. I hope I'm fine from saying that. But they control the game, you know? 